Hi there. Have you ever looked at the night sky and wondered what lies behind those twinkling points of light? Today, we are taking you on an extraordinary journey to the second planet from the Sun, Venus. At first glance, Venus looks like a beautiful, serene evening star, but don't be fooled by its appearance. Beneath that elegant facade lies a true hell. Did you know that Venus could have been Earth's twin? How did it transform into one of the most inhospitable places in our solar system? Why does a day on Venus last longer than its year? What makes its surface temperature hotter than a smelting furnace? Stay with us and you'll discover all these fascinating mysteries. This journey will be full of surprising facts, dramatic changes and incredible phenomena. Find out for yourself why Venus fascinates and terrifies scientists around the world. Let's check it out together. Let's start by imagining Venus billions of years ago. This planet probably had a lot in common with Earth. It might have had oceans, a moderate climate, and perhaps even conditions conducive to life. But something went terribly wrong. The fundamental problem with Venus is its atmosphere. It consists mainly of carbon dioxide, which means a powerful greenhouse effect. On Earth, carbon dioxide is also responsible for warming our planet, but on Venus, the scale of this phenomenon is unimaginable. Imagine we're in a greenhouse, but instead of a few plants, there are tons of greenhouse gases. The surface temperature of Venus is about 465 degrees Celsius, hot enough to melt lead. It's like trying to survive in a sauna cranked to maximum heat with no way to escape. Additionally, Venus is home to a vast number of volcanoes. Some of them are even active today. Volcanic eruptions release additional amounts of carbon dioxide and other gases into the atmosphere, further raising the temperature. On Venus, it probably never reached the balance that we see on Earth, where carbon dioxide emissions are offset by its absorption by oceans and plants. Imagine Venus as a giant furnace that constantly adds wood to the fire, never allowing it to cool down. Another key factor is the lack of a strong magnetic field on Venus. On Earth, the magnetic field protects us from the solar wind, which is, well, a stream of charged particles ejected by the sun. Without this protection, Venus was more exposed to the solar wind, which gradually stripped away its atmosphere, depleting it of hydrogen and oxygen, the essential components of water. Interesting fact, a day longer than a year. Venus has another unusual phenomenon. Its day is longer than its year. The planet rotates very slowly on its axis. One full rotation takes 243 Earth days. Meanwhile, Venus orbits the Sun in 225 Earth days. It's as if a day lasted almost two of our months. Additionally, Venus rotates in the opposite direction to most planets, meaning the Sun rises in the west and sets in the east. Interesting fact. Atmosphere higher than mountains. On Venus, there is one of the tallest volcanoes in the solar system, Maxwell Montes. It's taller than Mount Everest, measuring about 11 kilometers in height. However, unlike on Earth, where the highest peaks rise above the clouds, on Venus, this entire gigantic volcano is enveloped in a dense atmosphere. Debunking popular myths. Venus has always been this hot. Not true. Venus probably had a moderate climate for a long time. 
The climate changes that turned it into hell were the result of prolonged greenhouse effects and volcanic activity. Myth. Venus is Earth's twin. Although Venus and Earth are similar in size and mass, their conditions are drastically different. Venus exemplifies how delicate the climatic balance is and how easily it can be disrupted. Myth. Humans may one day colonize Venus. From a technical standpoint, colonizing the surface of Venus is extremely difficult. Extreme temperatures, pressure, and a toxic atmosphere mean that current technologies cannot provide safe living conditions. However, there are experimental ideas, such as floating cities in the upper layers of the atmosphere, where conditions are somewhat more tolerable. Conclusion Venus is a fascinating but also terrifying place. It's a reminder of how complex the processes shaping planetary climates are and how delicate the balance is that maintains our living conditions on Earth. Hopefully, the study of Venus will help us better understand our own planet and how to avoid similar climate disasters. For now, we can admire Venus from a distance and learn from its history. Who knows, maybe one day we'll find a way to study this hot planet even closer without risking being burnt to ashes. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss the next fascinating topics. See you in the next episode.